We've lined up 22 special videos this week, but turn on biohazard defense mode because it's coal rolling time. Mike was driving on Route 15 when he was overtaken by a pickup driver that decided to roll some coal on him. At first Mike was feeling special, but then the pickup driver overtook a cyclist and did the same thing to them. Mike had no previous interactions with the driver and this was a road he rarely drove on. He also never left the right hand lane until he decided he didn't want to be behind the truck driver. This had to have been some sort of anti-environmentalism action. Sarah's Model 3 was driving her to work in Sacramento, California. Yes, we do mean that Autopilot was engaged. She noticed a lifted pickup truck approaching from behind and overtaking her in the leftmost lane. When she saw it, Sarah couldn't believe this had actually happened. She's one of our regular viewers and thought this was something she'd only ever see on Wham Bam. But now it had happened to her. There's actually a saying that you aren't a real Tesla owner until someone has rolled coal on you. Welcome to the club, Sarah. Will was driving south on Highway 1 when the driver of a Ford F-250 decided to roll coal on him. Will points out that this wasn't merely caused by acceleration since they were already going uphill and the smoke only started once the truck was in front of Will's Tesla. The reason we point this out is because we always have a bunch of comments on these videos telling us that these incidents aren't intentional. Diesel vehicles just do this naturally when accelerating. Will says the list of offenses committed by this pickup driver was so annoying. Passing on the right, disabling his emissions control system, intentionally obscuring another driver's view of the road, Road, not to mention reckless driving. On the second day of owning his Tesla, Ryan was giving a friend a demonstration of autopilot when an aggressively driving truck shot the gap and rolled coal on them. Later, Ryan got stuck behind the truck at a traffic light, so he gave a little extra time to avoid getting caught in any more smoke. That's when the driver of a Lexus decided to cross over two lanes right in front of him. David was driving his Model Y in Abbotsford, Canada when he had a feeling that a modified diesel truck was setting up to roll coal. Indeed he was. As traffic was moving along, he purposely slowed down as the vehicle in the right lane took the exit. Little did he know that David was getting ready to dodge his black smoke barrage. Thanks to the power and torque of David's Tesla, the unsuspecting truck blew his opportunity to blow smoke, releasing his cloud of contamination a little too late. Better luck next time, Dodge. While using autopilot on his regular morning commute, Steven noticed the big bore exhaust on this pickup and thought to himself, this guy is gonna roll coal on me. The truck driver moved over to do just that before speeding back into the left lane. Steven couldn't see a thing when this happened, so he's glad autopilot was able to keep him in his lane. Kyler was driving his Model 3 in Monroe, Louisiana on Independence Day when a speeding truck drove by and rolled coal on him. This video is from longtime viewer Jennifer, who was driving her Model 3 on autopilot. She approached a construction zone with a speed limit of 30 miles per hour, which autopilot obeyed. Apparently, the driver of a pickup truck behind her got very upset that she was obeying the construction zone speed limit. They decided to roll coal on her, blocking other drivers' view of the road ahead and making the air worse for everyone. Jennifer says that when the truck was passing her, she thought she saw a patrol cap, part of an army soldier's uniform, sitting on the truck's dash. Incredibly, another Tesla was right behind Jennifer's and it was being driven by Travis, who also sent us his footage of the incident. You know how much I love multi-Tesla action. Travis knows of a police officer in Fountain, Colorado, who's compiling a database of coal rolling incidents in an effort to combat this behavior in Colorado. With that database in mind, Travis stopped and spoke with Jennifer about the incident. It turned out they are both Wham Bam fans. Thanks to you both for watching. Okay, let's roll the next clip. Oh, <clears throat> sorry for that. That pun was not intentional. Nicholas was shocked while driving his Tesla on I-80 to find someone in West Des Moines, Iowa that would want to roll coal on a Tesla. He noticed that the individual spotted his Tesla and sped up to get next to him, but Nicholas hit the juice pedal to keep them from rolling coal on him. 
the Tesla's instant acceleration saved the day. Nicholas tells us he thought this sort of thing only happened in other places and didn't expect to experience it in Iowa. While stuck in traffic in Auckland, New Zealand, Paul saw this ute taking a rest after rolling coal. Based on the vehicle's wrap, rolling coal is not the only type of smoking that these guys enjoy. Emily was driving to work by a university in Charlotte at 7 a.m. when the pickup truck in front of her suddenly started to blow smoke. What do you think about this one? Unintentional pollution or intentional coal rolling? Liam was on his way to breakfast in his brand new Model 3. He had his windows down and was enjoying the beautiful weather when a truck pulled out in front of him and rolled coal. He wasn't expecting this and had to roll up his windows after the smoke settled right where he had to wait at a red light before a right turn. Very fresh indeed. Ty was driving his Model 3 in North Wales, Pennsylvania when he pulled up behind a truck at a red light. The truck had dual rear wheels and a license plate that meant 10 miles per gallon. Ty thought, this is it, he's going to roll coal on me. But then the truck pulled away, leaving only a tiny puff of pollution. Was this a friendly version of rolling coal? Okay everyone, apparently it isn't just pickup trucks that roll coal. This next video is from John in Portugal who tells us they have something called running coal. It's very common for small diesel cars with illegal alterations to run coal in Portugal. Owners remove the diesel particle filters from their cars, leaving pollution on the road and in the air. John also says the police in Portugal do absolutely nothing about these illegal modifications. Okay, this clip isn't exactly about rolling coal, but Jonathan was driving in Port Orange, Florida when he saw a broken gas car rolling steam. I guess that's preferable to rolling coal. This move can actually be used to perform a magic trick. Let me show you what I mean in this next video. Have you ever seen a car disappear? Daniel was casually driving down the street when he suddenly found himself inside a big cloud of smoke coming from the car in front of him. After slowing down to drive through the smoke, it seems like the car had disappeared. It was only after reviewing his Tesla cam footage that Daniel saw that the car had pulled off to the side. Okay, back to good old black smoke. The guy driving this big pickup truck noticed Damon driving a Tesla, so he decided to roll coal on him. Damon says that the first little spurt was comical, but with the second one, he managed to make a bit larger cloud. Damon says he didn't do anything to provoke this assault. Julian was supercharging in Eureka, California when a pickup truck lined up to roll coal on multiple Teslas. He drove by, rolling coal on all the Teslas at the supercharger. We can only imagine how all the Tesla owners must have looked at each other while remarking, Wow, that guy is so cool! Colin was driving his Tesla in Blacksburg, Virginia when a pickup truck with a window sticker reading Compensator passed him. Anyone want to guess what the driver is compensating for? Colin got behind him to pass a slower moving Audi, and that's when the truck driver rolled coal on him. Colin says the truck driver blew smoke at him two or three times, and he's not sure if it was intentional or not, but it sure felt like it. Leave a comment and tell us what you think about this one. Michael was driving his Model 3 in Red Deer, Canada. A pickup truck had been following him for a while, and Michael was pretty sure he knew what the driver was up to. Eventually, Michael let him pass on the right, and sure enough, the guy rolled coal on him. Michael hopes the truck driver sees this and wants him to know that it was the lamest coal rolling he's ever seen, and he even laughed at how lame it was. Please stop doing this. Jaden was driving in Houston, Texas when, as he puts it, too much illegal gas came out of this truck. That guy really needs to get his truck fixed so it stops farting dinosaurs. Scott and Cheryl were traveling at about 60 miles per hour in the fast lane in their Model 3 when a white Dodge Ram pulled onto the road. It looks like the driver hammered the accelerator and blew the bottom of the engine out. 
Some small debris and a little bit of oil hit their Model 3, but no permanent damage was done to the Tesla. We understand that this guy was probably just trying to accelerate to merge into traffic, but how poetic would it be if he'd been trying to roll coal before his engine fell out? I think on some level, we all wish that on coal rolling pickup drivers. Please stop rolling coal on people. You're only damaging the planet we all have to live on while simultaneously proving how hard diesel trucks really blow.